ever play pin the tail on a donkey when you're a youngster? Oh, sure. Okay, that's what it's like. You spin around, and uh, all of a sudden, your whole, your whole orientation is thrown off. The map in your head is, is gone. It's a visual world. And when that's taken away, a good part of it, of the world is taken away. The unemployment rate among the blind is nearly 70%. I was very, always very proud to tell people to say, I'm a piano tuner. When, when you hear a, a note sound on a piano, you're not, what you're hearing is everything in that piano. Reverberations from the case, the, the cast iron plate, the soundboard. That's good enough for jazz. Out of 12,000 intersections in New York City, only 77 crosswalks are audibly cued. I mean, New York is a city of perpetual and, and eternal construction. You never know when you're going to find a scaffolding, manhole, ditches, you never know what's going to happen. The first time I took the bus by myself, I was nine years old, and I was going to fourth grade. Uh, so I've been doing this for a long time. Smart technology has changed the way many visually impaired New Yorkers interact with their city. Derek Jeter brings plenty of optimism in Yankees' first full spring training workout. We used to always envy the sighted guy that could sit there in the morning and drink his coffee and read his paper. Mm. And now, you know, it's, it's there. It's, it's all in there. But not too long ago, you would carry the money identifier with you, and then what else? Then you had the color the identifier. color identifier. You had the. So he has You had all the, those the GPS with the receiver and the collar. Oh you look like Batman. To better understand the lives of the 2% of New Yorkers who live each day in the dark, our filmmaker will spend one week blindfolded. I'd like to be dark, I'm calling it, right. for a full week. Whoa. And, um... Yeah. Even, even, not, not, even when you come home. Yeah. I think that's a great thing for you to do, I really do. I don't like it. You know, growing up, I saw in schools, like, there was always a day where they were like, you're gonna put a blindfold on for an hour to see what it's like. And people always came off of it being, like, terrified and mystified, and you don't know about the different alternative techniques or the landmarks that we use. It really scares people more than it informs them. You know, there's a lot of blind people are afraid of the sight of people are trying to patronize them more, put them down. I'm going, I'm going, no, man. It's just that sight is so powerful that it's hard to comprehend uh, the concept of not having it. Share the trailer. See more. Support the film nyafterdarkmovie.com